Hi, right, Chandler Vessels here for HSN with Mount Vernon head coach Josh Finney following his team's 32-26 comeback victory against Tatum here in Gilmer in the by district round. Um, coach, you guys went into that fourth quarter down 26-10 to 10 and ended up scoring three straight touchdowns. Can you just sort of describe the emotions that you're feeling right now? You know, it's just hard to even translate that into words, you know. First, I want to tip my hat to Coach Highlander and staff and, you know, they do a great job over at Tatum. Those kids play hard and, you know, and it was just a great football game on, you know, it's a shame one of these teams have to go home on the first round of the playoffs, but, you know, just the roller coaster emotions of, you know, being down that far in the fourth quarter and just, that's a tribute to my kids. They just won't quit. They had every reason to quit, you know, fumble it in the end zone when we were, you know, and uh, just keep scratching and clawing and guys making plays and they just, and I'm so proud of them boys. Yeah. And then Cade's 50 yard run, he, he breaks free around the, around oh, the heck, corner. Oh heck, you know, we, we was just trying to get a first down. You know, yeah. I was trying to eat the clock up and I wasn't even trying to score. And uh, you know, he just, ha he's just had that potential and ability all year long and he's, he's done it, done it, done it. And he's just a workhorse that we keep going to. And, and uh, but man, our offensive line, our, we rotated in nine linemen tonight. Non, they just keep firing off, keep firing off, keep firing off. And not many people do what we do anymore. Um, speaking of that, I mean, they're, they're, they're knowing what you're going to do coming into the game, just and you guys are still. <laughs> it's much deserved, but uh, but I'm just them knowing what you're going to do every coming into the game. They know what your game plan is, um, and you guys are still able to have a lot of success on the ground. Just what do you attribute that to? Uh, <laughs> just, those those kids got a big heart. Yeah, and. Uh, you know, they play with a lot of guts, and uh, you know it's just two things you can't coach. So, um, and then lastly, I'll just talk about let you talk about your defense. You mentioned uh, giving them a couple minutes left to score there at the end. They come away with the stop, but really just that entire quarter, your defense was really locked down. Um, just what did you think about the way that they played, especially um, down the stretch? You know, my defense coordinator, Coach Tolis, you know, really dialed up a great game plan to slow them down and. Uh, you know, just big time. There's just several guys making plays. It's not just one or or, or same guy over and over. It's just a, a bunch of guys that are able to make plays. And, you know, you can't look at the defense and say, oh, we got to block this guy or this, you know. They just all fly around and hustle. And we don't think we got a guy over, over 200 pounds. Um, and uh, that just attributes to their willingness to fly to the football as fast as you can and help out. All right. Appreciate it. Congratulations. Thank you. Sorry about the walk.